That's the biggest learnings from, from, the, you know, from the earlier project is that in, uh, since 2012, we actually are gaining experience and learnings from hybrid solutions, operating those, but also earlier having them installed and having actually looked into the whole value chain. This learnings is the most beneficial when you look ahead in the new pro for the new projects. So basically, it's important that we gain learnings from, from all steps in the value chain from the sizing, from the siting, to the asset integration, and then construction and service. Because this actually knowledge is the strongest, you can say, uh, contribution learnings when you look forward for the new projects. Hybrid solution can be applied globally, so it's a global solution. But of course, we see differences in the grid requirements and the challenges with that, but also in the remuneration schemes. So, a hybrid solution will be always a co-created solution for a specific project. It means we will tailor the solution and also the size of the turbines, um, uh, the storage and, and the PV part uh, in a way that it best meets the requirements but also the remuneration schemes in the markets. This is aiding the integration of renewable power to the grid uh, because Vestas is as a leader in the sustainable energy uh, generation, um, always following the different developments in the grid requirements across the globe. So we intend to deliver first class solutions across the globe in every market where we, um, where we deliver Vestas products. Yeah, the biggest challenge um, right now is that we see the energy market in a transition. And with that, we also see that uh, the way how our customers are compensated is, is changing as well. So it's changing from fixed guaranteed remuneration prices into more variable, flexible electricity prices. And, and with this challenge, we actually have to adapt our, our technology in a way that we actually ensure that we deliver energy, energy, energy you know, output in a way how actually our customers are benef benef benefiting most. So in general, Vestas is not relying on a specific storage technology. So we are combining the technologies in a way that it suits best to the market requirements and the grid requirements in a specific project. Um, that's why we look more into okay, being flexible in the selection of technologies. However, when I personally look into the potentials which are within the storage technology, I believe that this, techno this technology is still in a steep learning curve. So I'm really looking forward to see the next development steps of the storage technologies to support us to deliver the most attractive solution to the customers.